complex mechanical engineering shop. What am I doing here? What are you doing here? You're gonna be our star. You'll be going to NASA's Johnson Space Center next month for Rascal Exploration Robots competition. What would I be doing there? A lot of things. You'll be in JSC Rock Yard climbing slopes, rolling over rocks, and even picking some up. We hear there's strange aliens lurking out there too, though, so keep an eye out for them. Oh, by the way, the whole world will be watching you over the internet, so no pressure. Oh, don't worry, it'll be fun. We'll be watching over your shoulder from here at Caltech, so you'll be all right. How can you watch me in Texas when you're here in California? That's a good question. Eight USB webcams are connected to, to your AMD NetTalk, which is connected to Verizon's 4G network, which then is connects to the internet, which then connects to this computer, where the camera feeds are displayed. To control you, information from the joystick and keyboard over here are then sent back across the internet to the NetTalk, which is then connected to an Arduino microcontroller, which then actually controls the servos and motors. So you said that I'll be going up slopes and picking up rocks. How would I be able to do that? Well, actually, that's what we've been working on for the last few months. Let me show you. Your four wheels are connected via rocker system, so you can drive over rocks up to 20 centimeters high. Each of your wheels is also independently steerable, which allows you to navigate in tight places. You also have a 6-degree freedom arm, which will enable you to pick up rocks. Hey, there's a group of middle school students waiting to see you. Do you want to go outside and meet them? Sure! Wow, that was fun! Do you enjoy doing the rover competition as well? Yeah, rover team is a blast! What made you join? I had a great time doing robotics in high school with programs like FIRST, and then I got to college and I heard about this really cool ro Rascal RoboOps competition, and now I get to spend my nights working with mechies and physicists, and we'll find a problem, and someone will come up with a really neat solution, and we get to see our ideas transform from our minds to this actual robot. But Daniel, you're the one that got everyone together. How'd you hear about this? Well, I started out with a NASA tweet and I thought that, hey, this sounds really cool. It did turn out to be really cool and it gave me a really big picture view of how engineering is like in this kind of space missions. I'm somebody who really want to be part of space exploration in the future, but I think I'll probably be part of a much larger team working on a much smaller bit of a project. So this project, this competition will be a really unique experience for me and I think for all of us as well. Hey, look at all those people on the bridge. Let's go check it out. Hey,